This is meal number 15, chimichurri steak with roasted potatoes, mushrooms, caramelized onions, and marinated red peppers. 15 to 18 minutes prep time. And we just received it, uh, let's see, today, which is the 21st. So we've got about a week to do it. Here is the little slab of meat, exactly one portion. There is just one portion's worth. Here are some of the ingredients. Nice that they don't have anything in here that doesn't make sense to anybody. So the setup here is separate the extra tray with the potatoes, mushrooms, onion tray, then remove the plastic film from the potatoes tray. All right, so this is all integrated, this, this particular one. And we got the marinated red peppers here. This is Tovala steak seasoning. We got a bag of crispy onions. And this, is, this must be the chimichurri sauce. Nice, I like it when they do it like this because all you do is pretty much open it up. Okay, so there's a separate tray. Put the steak in the in the tray. I'm gonna remove this, put the steak in the tray, and scan. Most likely that's it. Sprinkle the seasoning. So I do sprinkle the steak seasoning on here. Okay, so got that. Put it in the, sprinkle the Tavala steak seasoning on a steak, creating an even layer of seasoning on the topping. It's got salt, pepper, paprika, onion powder. And what else is in here? All right, now we scan it, hit the barcode, scan it, and then after you scan it, put it in there, and you remove both trays from the oven, let the steak rest in the tray for two to four minutes untouched, then transfer the steak to potatoes on a plate. Then shake, lead, gen shake the chimichurri and drill fill it over this steak. Optional, put the marinated red peppers or potatoes on the side. See if we can get it to look like that. Take the steak out. Looks pretty well done. And a little piece of blood there. Got the potatoes. Drop the potatoes. Good. I would have liked it, preferably more medium rare, so I could have taken the steak out a little bit sooner. All right, not too bad. It's a little bit bloody. All right. Now, got this on the side. Fresh 
festive. And then the chimichurri sauce, which here. Well, that's about it for this meal. I think the results look really good. The steak was nicely done, very moist. If I had to do it over again, I would probably set it so that it is a little bit more meat or mirror. I like it a little bit bloody. Potatoes are fantastic. Overall, I think this is a pretty good meal if you like the chimichurri flavor. I would personally pick something else though, but that's just my own personal taste.